So look right here, Amanda can get into every nightclub within the surrounding <laughs> area. She's got a, a VIP bracelet to every place. No, it's because we have to wear Malia's because she won't wear them, right? You won't put all those things on your wrist, will ya? What's up, guys? <laughs> hey guys, how's it going? We're at the Jacksonville Zoo today. Here it's on the beautiful St. John's River. And we are gonna show you today what's in this sensory bag here. The sensory inclusive bag provided by the Jacksonville Zoo. And we're gonna go through all the content. with Culture City. Yeah, Culture, Culture City. City. We'll have to look them up and see yes. what they're all about. Malia's all excited. We're gonna show you what's in this bag. We're hoping there's some good stuff in there for all of us. Probably not, just Malia. But Isaac might want to use something in it. I don't know. We'll see. And here we go. We're gonna get started. It is available at no cost. You just have to sign it out and put down your phone number so they know who had it. Has sensory stuff, like stuff to help special needs. Sensory. Um, they give you a paper that shows everything that's in it, but I'll just go ahead and take it all out. Noise canceling headphones, because nice. like the train ride and stuff can be loud. The monkeys can be loud too. The monkeys can be like that loud. one right there. <laughs> Communication oh, card, cool. which is cool. So it has all different options, and then the back you can actually go over your emotions. So if they're feeling upset, they can tell you that's what cool. they're feeling. Molly is like, what's in the bag? Show me. I want to know. This just shows staff that your kiddo might need a little bit extra help. That's good to have. And one of Malia's favorite things actually is for therapy. It's called a tangle. If you have an autism kiddo, you've probably seen these. It's a fidget toy. You can just twist it all different ways. A little squeezy Ooh, a stress ball. sensory ball. They wipe these down and disinfect them between each kid. No, no, that's why and they that's clean them. And that's why they clean them as we need yeah, to get it. And it all just goes in this little backpack so that staff knows even if you don't have the card out. So there you have it. Places are definitely getting better at providing special needs kids stuff to cope with all their different and it's awesome sensory yeah. challenges. That they're not, you don't have to pay for them. They yeah. Just... All right, guys. So we hope that you learned a little bit about the sensory bags at Jacksonville Zoo. Hopefully your zoo will have something similar. If not, look up Culture City. We're gonna do more research into them and maybe you can get it implemented in your zoo. All right, so thanks for watching. Make sure you like this video, leave any questions or comments. We'd love to talk about it. Also, please comment down below if your zoo has something like this culturecity.org bag, because that'd be really cool to see and learn about. And we might even visit your zoo too. Thank you. Bye. 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 Can I do the close up? Yeah.